Hi, today we're going to be talking about what to expect during your IV hydration treatment. Generally, we perform a physical examination that is overseen by Dr. Jonathan Zelkin. The ideal site of your IV is determined by Dr. Zelkin and his staff, and either he or one of his associates will cleanse the arm with an alcohol swab. The vein of choice is then prepared and a tourniquet is placed to make it very easy to find. An angiocath is basically an IV introduction needle and it's painlessly inserted into that vein. Although it may not look comfortable, patients usually do not report any pain with this procedure. This is performed very delicately and then the IV line with the fluid in it is primed, meaning that all the air is taken out. After the IV angiocath is inserted into the vein successfully, the primed IV line is then adapted to the angiocatheter. This is next secured into place using either porous tape or a specialized window. The IV catheter is then opened up so that the fluids can be introduced into your venous circulation as soon as possible. We open this up using a valve on the IV line. Next, any constituents of the IV solution are added as you see. The IV bag can take as long as an hour to run through, so be patient and make sure that you have your appointment scheduled appropriately. 